Good morning. I am on my way to see my friends. We are having breakfast as usual at the Steak and Shake or Wednesday morning tradition. And then we are going to the farmer's market together. Um, it is currently 9 a.m. Everybody's already there and I am late as usual. Um, I made a little packed lunch for Derek, so I'm going to go drop that off at the convention center for him before heading to the Steak and Shake. Everybody's probably already there and I'm way late. But we will see. Okay, so it's about 10 past 9 now, so I'm not like atrociously late, I'm just pretty late. And uh, I will see you at the Steak and Shake. At some point you want to say hi to Derek, or want to drop off some snacks for him. This is probably where he's going to be living for the next while. Wow, oh. they're already at it. Super busy. Ooh. It's intense in here. Big doings. You can feel it. It's more that he's kind of not a morning guy, so he's a little cranky. Oh, you're so sleepy. Cranky. It's the morning. <laughs> And I'm sure they're going to be standing up for free, so if I get there a little early, just get in. Are you going to just go wait in line? Yeah, I think I'm going to get in here. It'll probably get out of the way and then go yeah. get all the stuff ready for the steak thing. And I'll catch up with you guys beforehand, obviously, if I can work it. So. Yeah. Getting our badges. Only Hopefully. took us five minutes to walk to the end of the line. <sighs> Probably not that long. Haven't hit quite the end of the hall yet. Two, two, two people quit or guilt today. Yep. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see how long it takes. Stuart, where are you staying? 
staying at the Marriott downtown. Looks like the Marriott downtown is sponsored by the Bob Ross game people. Okay. <laughs> there you go, now you know where to go. Thanks. You Three can, numbers. You played two hideouts. Hi. I won the game. You lost the game. Damn it. <laughs> I won the game. You got away. You're I off did. to a vacation in Rio. How'd you like it? It was, it was nice. I won, so. Yeah. You're always so excited when you get reviews for games. Good job. Jordan's here. I'm very tired. You are tired. He's going to get some tickets from me. By the way, I did will call. Oh I got goodness. my tickets. I got a couple of tickets for my events. Are you, are you planning on making copies of yourself so you can play? So not really a whole bunch has happened. Jordan is here. He is a friend from Seattle. It's his first time at Gen Con. So really, we just walked around the convention center showing him around. We were at the food court, got some, got a little bit of food. And Melissa and Eric are on their way over to hang out with us. Um, it's been really fun, but really nothing has happened. We played Fugitive. What do you think of Fugitive? It wasn't bad. It was not bad. This is the best review was... I've heard so far from Stuart. It was interesting. My, my wife might like it. We've got about two hours to go before the stink. That's about it. That's all I got. Finally getting in our air hockey time. Jordan versus Heather. I just kicked Jordan's butt. So um, Heather is taking uh, Heather is taking it on while I'm taking a break because I've played all of the games so far, and it's so much fun. going as usual. Uh, I really love the stink and what it stands for but, but the more I go to it and the less the forums are a big deal. Um, they used to be huge but just the, the times are moving forward. People don't use forums as much. The Gen Con forums personally I just don't think work quite as well as they used to. The individual groups don't have their individual pages anymore where people can come. It's a little different, um, and as you can see, you know, the stink is pretty great. It's dragging in a whole lot of people, but a lot of those people are just sitting at tables, not doing anything, and it kind of feels like a wasted opportunity. People come here, and then they just kind of sit around. It would be really cool to see what Gen Con or what we could do with the event. You know, maybe we could have people that like actively encourage people to play games and demo games and teach people how to game and try and generate groups or maybe just make the event something a little more beyond hi talk to people because that's awkward but I still love it I'm here I'm meeting a lot of people and it's been really exciting I just see potential and I'm not certain how to best use it up Gen Con, yes. Good. Anything you want to say? Uh, no. Okay. Good. I'm Good here call. under protest. <laughs> <laughs> under video protest. Message received. You do this to me every time. Every we're time. Together. <laughs> every time. Hi guys. Hey everybody. Introduce yourselves. I'm Heather. I'm Scott. Tim. Hi guys. Where are you guys from? Rockford, Illinois. And we are Pick Up and Go Games. Yep. Awesome. Where can people find you? PickupandGoGames.com. Uh, what is Pick Up and Go Games for people who have no idea what you just said? Well, we specialize <laughs> in small, easy, simple role-playing games and quick card games that are 
two to four people or so. Oh, okay, that's really fun. I'll make sure to let Ken the doobly do. What are you most excited for this Gen Con? Oh my gosh, this is Gen Con 50, and my first Gen Con was Gen Con 25. So just being able to make it to Gen Con 50 is that's kind of awesome. mind blowing. It's crazy. I mean, it's huge, but I got to give kudos to all the staff. I was in and out of will call and customer service, I think, in about 15 minutes. These guys, you are rocking it this year. Thank you so much for everybody who is on the staff this year. You guys are killing it already. Yay! Personally, I just love going to the auction house. I love playing some Pathfinder games, which I got my friend into. Yeah. And, uh, Finally gonna level up my character. Are you gonna play Starfinder? Oh hell yeah, I'm gonna play Starfinder. And I will be GMing uh, through Nascrag. So if anybody is looking for some fun, simple, uh, run with Pathfinder system, but you don't need to know it, silliness, get out there, just have a good time. We will be in Lucas Oil, which is we'll be like 10 yards away from the horticulture exhibit. Yeah. I want to go to that so bad. I do too. No. I don't even know if we can get in now. I kind of want to see. You remember it? Yeah, right. I do. I remember. I don't remember that. I remember from the Mecca Center, the original Mecca Center. That's so cool. And whatnot. And yeah, it was... Hey Tim, what about you? Uh, me, it's a lot of Pathfinder Society. Yeah? Uh, <laughs> yeah, this, this man's gonna... He, he might as a well lot. get a cop in the Sagamore <laughs> Ballroom. Yeah. She's um, that, uh, tomorrow I got a couple uh, writing uh, workshops I'm heading to that I'm really kind of looking forward to. Awesome! Um, other than that, just, yeah, Pathfinder and the trying to go with the mad rush tomorrow morning to get my start fight. Um, what's your name? <laughs> my name's Eric from Evansville. Evansville, Indiana? Yes. Very cool. He's a yeah. maven. Yes. Awesome. Why are you at Gen Con? This is my fifth year here. Uh, fifth year. I love playing this. I think this. too, actually. Really? Yeah, 2012. Yeah. Yeah. High five. I love playing Dungeons and Dragons, and uh, I just love coming here and meeting all the people. Okay. Are you by yourself or are you uh, with friends? I got friends. Uh, there's five of us here. They're at the uh, cake tapping. The cake tapping, yeah. yeah. I I'm need to get some here. of that. Yeah. I'm the only one here. What are you most looking forward to this year? Uh, one, I was meeting you. And <laughs> that makes me so happy. <laughs> <It was. laughs> uh, want to play some games and uh, check out everything. Awesome. Well, it was really nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I bet we will run into each other again. I hope so. And have a good con. You too. Bye. Bye. Hi guys. Hi. Hi. Introduce yourselves. I'm Kayla. I'm Sean. What do you guys do? Uh, I work for Microsoft. I'm a tool and die maker. What are your nerd interests? Nerd interests. Gaming all the time, obviously. Role playing games, Marvel comics. Okay. Nice. I love everything in the weed and verse. We both really love Supernatural. Yeah. Oh, cool. My friend is running a Supernatural LARP. What? Here? At Gen Con? At Gen Con. Oh, that'd be amazing. You should I'm check it out. Find that. Yeah, you should check it out. I can introduce you. She's over there. Oh, thanks. Okay. What are you most looking forward to? Uh, <laughs> we are actually getting sort of unofficially married tomorrow. So there's that. Uh, if you see them, congratulate them. Uh, We're doing the uh, official event marriage ceremony oh, yeah. at Lucas Oil. That's so cute! We're not getting legal married yet, but this is we got engaged at Gen Con two years ago, so this will be our sort of symbolic nerd wedding. That's amazing! Yeah! I, I got engaged and married at Gen Con. I highly recommend it. You guys are going to be great. We're excited. Oh, thanks for being on my vlog. Thank you for Thank having you. us. Bye! Bye. I'm at Gen Con because I love gaming, like everyone else. Yeah. Um, this is my fifth year. I come with my husband. He actually invited me to come to Gen Con when we first started dating, but I couldn't get the time off. 
so um, he makes fun of me for. Um, I said I want to meet Nelly because yeah. I follow her on Twitter and I follow her videos, and so you guys should say hi. Her, hey. so <laughs> you can be in my video. You can be famous. Yes. No. <laughs> um, that's awesome. So nice to meet yeah, you. What's, what are you most looking forward to this year? Um, I'm actually looking forward to seeing She Kills Monsters tomorrow night at What is that? Um, it's a play um, about a woman who um, discovers that her sister played D&D. &D. I guess her sister was in a car accident, I think. Uh, when she's going through her stuff, she finds out that she um, played D&D &D and she wants to learn yeah. more about it and then she gets involved. Um, it was being promoted on Gen Con forums and I thought that looked really cool. I so, wonder if there's tickets left. Um, hmm, maybe I will go. It's Thursday night at 8 o'clock so it kind of it conflicts it's, with the, the they might be giant concerts. So oh, I'm not going to that, so yay! <laughs> They're giving out dice. Okay, I'm going to try and go to that maybe. I don't know if I have plans. Oh, thank you for so oh. Thank you so much! I'm back in the hotel room. We had buca di becco, be, buca di beppo for dinner. This one was kind enough to join us. I joined Derek at uh, GMHQ for a little bit and we chatted and now we're back in the hotel room and it's too late. It's like midnight, it's coming up on midnight. Yeah. And I will have to edit my video now and that's gonna take an hour, two hours, something like that. Earlier start to the day tomorrow. If we wanna meet up at the convention center at 9 a.m. So lots of plans, lots of things, lots of stuff. Good night.